Hi, it's Mark again, um, looking to show users of the free property management software, Property Manager 2.0, um, from PropertyHawkCo.uk, how to add a tenancy to a property. So, first of all, you need to choose the property from your portfolio that you want to add the tenancy to. So, I can go to the summary screen in uh, the on the management tab and I want to select portfolio view so that I can see all the properties within my portfolio now here on portfolio view we've got all the properties that I've added and down here 23 not really street Birmingham currently has no tenancies and I want to add a new tenancy to that so I'm going to select that property and here we have it selected. Okay, 23 Not Really Street, Birmingham. It's been selected in this drop down menu. And I'm going to add a new tenancy to that property address. So I click Add New Tenancy. Okay, it's now asking me if I want to select any of these uh, tenant details that I've used in the past. But for this uh, situation, I'm actually creating a new tenant details. He's a, a new tenant. I've never let to him before. So I'm going to skip this step. And it's asking me for his details. And he is Mr. Pete Best. And he has an email address of Pete Best at home and I'm going to give him a couple of made up telephone and mobile numbers okay there's no other tenants letting that property so he's all on his own so I'm going to press next okay it's now asking me for the description of that tenancy and the description is, well, it's a flat in a block that I own. And I'm calling it flat one because that's how I've got them numbered up. Um, yeah, I'm selecting it as a flat. Uh, number of bedrooms. Well, it's just a one bedroom flat. He's all on his lonesome. And it's unfurnished. And I'm taking a start date of the 3rd of April. And it's for a period of six months and it will be concluding on the 3rd of October there we go now the rent is £500 a month so frequency I'm going to set to monthly and it's an informal payment date well actually he's going to pay me on the 3rd so I, that's, that's a little memo for landlords who maybe arrange an alternative date for payment with the tenant um, so I'm going to just leave that blank or I can put in a third ok, deposit, well he gave me £500 in advance as his deposit happy with that, I'm going to now press next ok, in summary we've got Mr Pete Best, that's right the data is valid, so I can just click finish to save So that's completed that. It's now set up a tenancy. It will start the rental requests automatically. So if I go to check um, rent um, over the next few months, it will bring up automatic rent requests. Um, and all the details are there, basically. Um, and that's how you create a tenancy. So that's it for now. Um, I'll come back and add more help segments to different help areas um, in the right hand menu the property manager you should be able to see those help prompts and I'll start attaching some video to there okay that's it for now thank you